Two days ago, I discovered that Paul Stastny was still playing in the NHL. Well, he must have heard me and took it personally because he went out tonight and took the series for the Carolina Avalanche. And he's been on fire for the Canes with two goals already, and he just decides to take it from a filthy angle with no regard for Islander life. It starts when Derek Stepan, also a person I was somewhat surprised to learn still plays in the NHL, stretches out for a steal and just gets it, keeping it on side. Then he gets pressured by the D and he gets it down to my man, Paul Staz, sitting alone in the corner. And it's a perfect shot as he rips the bank right off Sorok and skated in. It was probably the only way for him to hit the five hole. And hey, the billiard shot works. And just like that, the Islanders playoff run ends as Executioner Paul eliminates them from cup contention. And my bracket gets even worse. The Isles did lead for three periods after a Cal Clutterbuck banger. And I mean it. Cal Clutterbuck, who had six goals all year, fired a laser beam to give them the lead in the first. The goal is a classic case of giving any competent NHL player space and time. And they'll make you regret it. Everyone in the NHL can can shoot nowadays, but the Cardiac Canes were back, tying it up with half a period left with their version of Sebastian Ajo. Then Stastny ending it in OT was the game. A huge defensive effort for this one. 41 saves for Sorokin and 34 for Canes starty Freddie Anderson, who now gives Coach Brindamore something to think about for their next game. And lots of sad Islanders fans in the stands, but hey, nothing to be sad about this year. Big trade and then signing Horvat. That was a great move that helped them get in the playoffs when they looked like they'd be on the outside looking in. If you remember, back when the trade was made, Made. I wasn't a huge fan of it. I didn't think they'd make the playoffs, but hey, look at him go. Sorokin took another step this year and played a career high 62 games, which is wild for a goalie at 27, and he looks great entering his prime years. As for the Canes, they're off to the second round again, where they will try to get the semis for the first time in 2017. And the second round has been a challenge for them, but they'll get at least an extra day off before finding out if they're facing the Rangers again or the Devils. Do you think Carolina is poised for a deep playoff run? And how many more goals is Mr. Paul Stasny going to score? Let us know down below.